Sig Kelm's a true legend to the Aston mm. Villa supporters, as you say. He's a good man to have on board, isn't he? Nice guy, really, really nice guy. And um, as I said before, he's probably one of the more revered football players at this, this club, along with the other lads that won the, the European Cup. So um, he'll come up and, and, and do really well. Yeah, did you watch him in that European Cup final on the telly? Did what? Did you watch him in the European Cup final? No, I did watch it, yeah. Yeah, I did watch it. So, But not, as I said before, I knew the Aston Villa team the back of my hand at that, that year or so. Um, but also know the, how much he is well, re well respected here. And he's worked with a lot of the young players, hasn't he? Both in his capacity, uh, working with, with the youth setup and when he was assisting before. Well, he, he knows the younger lads. I said, I, I, I try and go to as many the the young kids' games I can to, to go and watch them. So Gordon's been with them for for a while now, so um, he, know, he knows what's, what's there. And Shay Given, I remember you saying last season when, when he wasn't in the team, his attitude's still exemplary. Mm. You know, when he played in the cup games and, and he was a good guy to have around the place even then, so that, that all goes well. Oh, that's one thing I don't think anybody could ever label Shay, being no professional in what he does. Fantastic pro, no two ways about it. He's been a brilliant goalkeeper and in his career recognises that. So top top guy to to um and top top pro. Yeah, he can draw on the, all that Premier League experience, can't he? Well, well he knows he knows the game. See, he's, 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 as I said he's thirty six, thirty seven years of age, knows the game, knows exactly what what the game's like. So but never had a problem with him being professional the way he is. He does have outstanding knowledge listening to him on the radio last night, that, that came across. Mm. Uh, and also, yeah, he's, he's a popular guy, a good sense of humour, that'll help as well. No, he's, he's, he's a funny lad, and um, as I said before, he'll, he'll, uh, he'll see the game a little bit differently, might not be as easy as, as, as playing right enough, so uh, he'll see a different light. Yeah, but do you, do you think he will relish this opportunity? I certainly hope so, yeah. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure he will. But he, he'll find out it's, it's a little bit... Just a little bit different from, from playing. Yeah. How do you see Southampton then? They've uh, had a very good season. But no, very good. Yeah, we've been down there and beaten them in, in, a few months ago. So um, we uh, this, is a, this is a whole different different game, this one. We have to be ready for this one and, and go and try and win. Um, the fans can play their part. Yeah, as I said there, we're definitely going to need them. Definitely going to need them on Saturday to, to drive us through it. And the... And they will, they'll come in the thousands, I've always said, and they'll, they'll support the team.